Japan. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Oh wait, so y'all know it's the new year, right? Yeah, that old intro we had, ain't gonna cut it. Here's the new shit. So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing another day in my life, bro. Y'all already know where I am, the LED lights. The jackets on the door. You already know where I'm at. Anyways, it's 2:36 and it's Monday, January 4th. Second video of 2021. And so my first video of 2021 is going up today at 3 o'clock. Cause if you didn't know and if you're new, I upload all my videos at 3 p.m. Eastern time. Fun fact, but very very sad fact. I do not know the difference between Pacific time, Eastern time, Central. Like I, on Disney Channel, I did not know what the fuck that shit meant. But still watched it though. Are you dumb? Anyways, so yeah, I'm posting my video at three. If you didn't watch it, I'll link it in the description. Right now, I'm eating some pasta because last night I went to a restaurant. I always get pastas every restaurant I go to because I'm a basic bitch. So I'm eating fettuccine alfredo sauce and garlic bread that tastes so good. The purified water. Hey yo, new video check. My video is up. <gasps> Kenley, I'm giving you a shout out because you loyal as fuck. Like, so sweet. But yeah, my video's up finally. I'm so proud of myself because I filmed that video on Saturday, finished editing it yesterday, and then I got it up today. Right now, I'm about to just chill because I don't know what else to do right now. And thank you, Kenley, again, for always being on top of your shit, being supportive, being a supporter. I really appreciate that so, so much. And for the people that don't comment, but y'all still watch my videos, I appreciate that as well. 4.36 and I decided to do something. I'm not like too surprised because this tattoo, out of the blue. Like, I never had an appointment. This tattoo, never had an appointment. My piercing, never had an appointment. Like, I just woke up and I was like, let me go do this. So, here we go again. I'm getting another piercing. This industrial, I got in August. The piercing that I wanted to get, because I have two piercings right here, then I have my industrial. I really want to get my conch. I am going to call places to see like the best price I can do. I just really want to get it. All right. All right, hold on, let me search it up. Okay, I'm gonna call them and see what's the price. This is so like unexpected and if it doesn't work out, I'm just gonna delete this whole clip and y'all are not gonna see this at all whatsoever. Hi, um, I was just wondering how much is a conch piercing? $40. What time do you guys close? Uh, we close at 8 o'clock, but you wanna do that piercing, you're best to make an appointment so I don't know what time you're trying to come. Would 6 be okay? And are you trying to get a hoop or like a little stud? Yeah, stud. It's $40. A lot of these other places are pretty far. Angel numbers. Right now I'm gonna clean up Devin's room. So I'm just gonna like make the bed. Just put things where they're supposed to go. Fix up my area with the stuff that I brought. Clean off the dresser. I'm also gonna do my laundry and his laundry. Might as well do his, you know, because my stuff is literally in his laundry basket. So. All right, I'm in the car. Right now I'm going to the bank so that I can take the money out. We got it. Hey guys, it's like 5.49 right now and I am so nervous, let me tell you. With, but let me see the time. 
It's 5.52, so I'm gonna just head in. I'm so scared. Okay, this is my ear before. Hi, I'm back. Um, that was a very fast piercing. I don't know, I just have to get used to it. I don't know if it's because the jewelry. I feel like this one's too big. Okay, I'm gonna go back inside and then I'll show y'all the piercing when I'm done. Okay, now I'm back for real, for real this time. That was so, that was the least painful piercing I have ever gotten. Most definitely. It was so quick. Also, make sure you guys are making sure that if you pay for something and you do not like it, make sure that you speak up. You're using your hard work money to go get something that you want that you didn't even like. It's not that I don't like the piercing. I love the piercing. But the other one was just too big. Like, it was just too big. So I got the smallest one. I think it's really cute. But anyways, we're gonna go back now. New year, new piercing, okay? Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching this far. I'm gonna call my mom and get her reaction to see what she says. Yo, we in the bathroom with it. I really wish I brought my tripod because this is what y'all see right now. I'm about to make the paste. This is for anybody that has piercings and they're just trying to find a better way to clean it or make like a little bump go away. But for my industrial piercing, that one, I'm going to make a paste. And then for the one that I just got, I'm not gonna make a paste. I'm gonna just clean it just with salt water. Yeah, I think first I'm gonna make the paste though. This is the salt that I use. The natural sea salt by Morton, as it does not supply as iodized. Make sure that your salt does not have that. But this is how much salt I'm using. I have no idea if y'all can tell. And then cotton balls, whatever you want to call them. I use hot water. Hot water is just better. You're just gonna dip the Q-tip in the hot water and then put it in the salt. So I'm just gonna kind of mix it around. So basically, I'm just gonna grab a clump of it and then put it on the, the bump. I need to put way too much on some parts. This is what it should look like. So now I'm gonna clean my new piercing. But with this, just gonna rinse this cup out. And then I'm gonna get the hot water back on. I'm not gonna put a lot of water because this is already such a big cup. This amount should be good. I don't know if y'all can tell. Then we're gonna get our non-iodized salt. Put as much salt as you think is good. Just not too much because you don't want to irritate it. And then you're gonna grab a Q-tip. You kinda wanna go fast at this because you don't want the water to be cold. Just use a Q-tip and mix it around. Not this becoming an educational video. She's cleaned, I think. <laughs> And that's that. But I'm gonna go back in Devin's room and like finish cleaning it and stuff because I didn't finish doing that and do more laundry. What's up? Nothing. I wanna show you something. Mm -hmm. Turn around, let me see. Do you like it? They can't see it with me. They know someone with gold something there. No, it's silver. I tell you about the video. Anything you want, the way they do it. Me know, me don't know that. Okay. It's gonna turn 18. I saw it go. Okay. okay. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Bye bye. I don't know if my mom likes it or not. I'm gonna call my little brother. Hey, baby B. I did something. You like it? Is it ugly? You lagging like shit, nigga. This shit's trash as fuck. Can you see? Is it better now? It's not lagging no more, but the quality is dog shit. Well, do you see it? Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah, it looks good. Are you lying? Bruh, if I said it looks good, nigga, I good. Love you. Damn, ain't no love you back. Are you kidding me? If you guys have been on my channel for a minute, my intro that I had since in December, because it was like a Christmas theme type of intro, so now I have to change my intro, and I don't know what to do. I have no idea what song to do. I'm trying to look through my playlist right now. Oh, oh my god. I think I know. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go on YouTube. By the way, I showed you guys the intro in the beginning, but I didn't make it yet. Like, I did not make it. I have no idea what the intro looks like when I told you guys, here's the intro in the beginning. I have no idea what it looks like. I have no idea what song I chose. I have no idea how I did it. So that's why, that's what I'm talking about. So if you're like, bro, the intro was literally in the beginning. You literally already made an intro. No, I didn't. In my time, no, I did not. We're gonna choose a song, try to do the song Fox 5. Hey, I'm bumping with this! Yeah. Okay, I had I have an idea of how I'm gonna make it, but in the beginning before the beat drops, I have no idea what I'm gonna put right there. We'll see. Ah, this is about to be so fire. 
even though I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm gonna make this because it's gonna take me a minute. I think I'm gonna continue that brown theme that I had because brown is just such a beautiful color. <laughs> sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes. Yo, it's 7.33, I just finish my intro. Actually, this did not take me that long because, let me let y'all in on a little secret. It didn't take me that long because the last intro that I had for like the Christmas themed one, I literally just used parts of that video. I already wanted the brown and I wanted my name, that same font and everything. So I was just like, bro, why not, you know? But the intro came out fucking great. I hope that you guys liked it. So that will be my intro for a while now. I don't know how long, but a while until I get tired of it. Intros are just so fun to make because the music just be fire. It's a song where it's not fire and it's that basic shit like, yeah, I could never make an intro to a basic song. And I don't like using female songs because they're too like soft music. I like that hype music, you know? I just realized that I'm not gonna be able to wear my AirPods for a while. The battery's flashing. But anyways, I just wanted to tell you guys that I made my intro, I'm so happy. And I'm just about to chill for a little bit, continue cleaning and stuff, and then I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Yo! Bruh, I ain't gonna cut to you. It's been a couple of days, like I'm literally back at my house. By the way, I just got off of work. I don't know if y'all care, but it's 7.46, even though you can't see. But I just wanted to give you guys an update, um, because I didn't give you guys an outro. Just thank you for watching this video, basically. Road to 1K, we're almost there, guys. We're also really close to 900. So go tell your friends about my channel, your family. And if you're watching this video and you're not already subscribed, what are you doing? Go subscribe, like, go do it right now. We did a lot in this video, I feel like. We got a conch piercing. We made a new intro, which again, I hope that you guys enjoyed. We ate some bomb ass pasta. You guys also saw the reaction that my family gave about my piercing. We kind of just did a lot in this video, but not really too much. It was it was a chill day in my life, you know? Bro, my hair keeps getting caught in my butterfly earrings. Y'all go cop from Shein. You're welcome. This is what my piercing looks like. Like it doesn't give me pain as of right now. Before, all it did was like, I don't know, it just felt like an open wound. It kind of did bother me. It didn't hurt, it was just like an uncomfortable feeling. When I had my mask on, thankfully it didn't sit on my piercing like it did with this one. It would literally sit on my piercing and it would hurt. But this one doesn't do that. It just kind of puts pressure on my ear, but it's fine. Like it's not that bad. It doesn't hurt, it's just uncomfortable. But now, cause I went to work today and I had to wear a mask, it didn't give me that effect at all. I have been cleaning it with what I showed you guys in the video, the sea salt. I didn't even tell you guys a rating on this. This was like my least painful piercing that I've ever got. I'll probably give this like a three. So if you wanna go get your conch, go get your conch. Sleeping wise, I have to sleep like with my ear cuffed like this and I have to do that on both sides of my ears because this is not completely healed. Or I'll just lay with my head up, bro. Y'all see the Burger King in the back? Yeah. I'm about to grow up after this video, you already know. I'm trying to hurry up so I can go eat. Anyways. Oh yeah, if I don't lay like this, then I'll just lay like this, or I would lay like this, not on the piercing, you know? So it's kind of tricky to sleep, but you just gotta remember that you have piercing, and if you hit that bitch, it hurts. But I have hit it, and this one hurt way more, so much more than this when I hit it. It's a pretty chill piercing to have, I must say. But we have come to the end of this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I hope that you guys liked my intro. I also hope that you guys liked my piercing. If you have not already, do not forget to subscribe to this channel and press the notification bell so that you guys can be notified every single time that's your girl post. Do not forget to check out the description box so you guys can see my social medias to see what I'm doing when I'm not posting on YouTube. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Comment down below and let me know if you guys have any video requests or you can even DM me on Instagram and let me know what you're thinking. I got some strawberry Sprite over there. And I told y'all my New Year's resolution, no more plastic straws. Hell yeah, I got them hoes from Burlington. Which one are we gonna use? We'll use this one. Just in case if y'all don't believe me. This is gold, by the way. I was not capping. By the way, there's two of each and one of them is for my brother. Like, there's stuff in there for my brother. Okay, besides the point, but I hope that y'all boys enjoyed and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.